Hi guys, I'm Pekakin with another lecture. So in the previous lectures, I was uh, looking for sequences. If I look for a sequence, I use the sequence to come up with the formula. Then from the formula, I then uh, derive a, a Python uh, code that will help me in predicting numbers uh, coming in the future. So I dis discovered that uh, with ChatGPT, it's actually easy for you to come up with those uh, codes. All you have to do is just uh, type in a few things and then ChatGPT will do the rest for you. So here's an example. So I will say that uh, I have three numbers. Yes, O, M, A, E, C. So I need a Python code that is able to give me answers if I do the math a minus p plus c then a minus b minus c a plus b minus c and finally a plus b plus c then enter. Let's wait for the response. So here's the code. So in this code, the calculate results function takes in three numbers A, B, and C as input. It performs the calculations for the expressions you mentioned and uh, returns the results as a tuple. The example usage demonstrates how to call the function and display the results for given values of A, B, and C. Then it says, feel free to replace the example values with your own numbers when using this code. So let's try this code, copy the code, and then open PyCharm. So, new project. So, I copied uh, the code from ChatGPT. Let's try pasting the code here. Then, after pasting, I run. So here we have the examples here. They used their own values. A is equal to 10, B is equal to 5, C is equal to 2. So the results uh, for result 1 is 3, result 2, the answer is 7, result 3, the answer is 13, result 4, the answer is uh, uh, 17. But actually, I want to modify the code uh, so that it can ask me to enter the values of A, B, C. So let's try and uh, do that and see if it's possible. Instead of displaying uh, the results, I wanted to, to ask me to, to put the, the values. So see, I want to modify the code to ask me to me to Enter the values of A, B, and C. So, 
So the code has been modified, saying in this modified code, the float input uh, function is used to prompt the user to enter the values of A, P, and C. The entered values are then used to calculate the results using the calculate result function, and the results are printed to the console. So let's uh, try, try copy. And uh, let's go back to PyCharm. Paste. Let's run the code. So, as you can see, it's now asking me to enter the value of A. Let me just enter any number. Uh, 8. Let's just see. Enter 8. Then the value of B. Let me just say 6. The value of C. 7. So yeah, the results, the possible result, the result 1 is a 5, result 2 is 9, result 3 is 7, result 4 is a 21. Modify it, uh, the, try to modify the code. So if you type modify uh, code to give the results in one line in the results is bonus number and separate the answers using commas in one line. Example. So here's the example bonus number three seven eighteen seventeen. Then enter. So I've given it uh, an example of how I want the results to be displayed. So as you can see, it has now modified the code for me. And uh, it's now saying that in this modified code, the print statement has been updated to display the results in one line with commas. The results are labeled as bonus number followed by the corresponding values. So let's test it out and uh, see if it's, if it's worked. So remove this and then paste our new code. So it's going to ask me to enter the value of A. I'll just enter any random number, seven. Value of B, I'll just say even four. The value of C, C15. So as you can see, the results are now displayed as a bonus number. 32, uh, 2, 16, and uh, 46. So uh, I think this is how you can use uh, ChatGPT to create your own uh, code, guys. Uh, if you come up with a sequence, all you have to do is just to prompt uh, ChatGPT and uh, you get whatever code you need.